from under the vehicle or I will run you over. I'm not moving, Jack. There's a non-violent way to handle this. What's going on? Well, your father wants to leave and Bernie is staging a sit-in. Dad, come on, get up. This is ridiculous. Meet the Fockers, 2004, starring Ben Stiller, Robert De Niro. Uh, they're back. The whole cast is back here for a sequel to Meet the Parents. Now, this is a hard juggle here. This is a great sequel, a great comedy sequel. This is probably, to me, one of the most legendary ones. Um, I wasn't expecting much from Meet the Fockers until I watched it, and I watched it over and over. What a funny film. we got Barbara Streisand, Dustin Hoffman. It is. It, they come in just to add to this film, and they are funny, believe it or not, they pull it off as the parents of Mr. Fokker, uh, Ben Stiller. So it's the same premise here. Basically, they put into the first movie to the second, but they do it really well and more funny. Uh, you know, there's more for De Niro to get into on to Stiller, and it's more for Stiller to stress about here. So you got to appreciate what they try to do here with Meet the Fockers. They tried to up the ante, and they did since Meet the Parents. Now, here's the question. Is Meet the Parents better than Meet the Fockers? Uh, you know, that's something I'll let you decide in the comments down below. Let me know the real world viewer which one is your favorite i'm gonna go out and just stay with my heart here i would recommend meet the fockers i would rather watch meet the fockers uh than meet the parents and i've watched meet the parents over and over millions of time on a vhs recorded tape and i love meet the parents but meet the fockers man really has me smiling really entertained throughout there's no little slow burn no slow parts it's all funny and it's all interesting meet the fockers probably one of the best if not the best fockers movie you're gonna see uh this is it right here. Pinnacle. Yes! Teach me, Streisand, how to do those stretch yoga workouts!